What's up guys? So I finally got my new opener installed uh, yesterday. <clears throat> it is a LiftMaster. Um, I guess it's kind of like a commercial grade opener. So the deal was with the old opener, it's still up there, I just left it. Uh, because this beam that was that's in the middle of my garage, they had to put the opener in front of that beam. And because they did that, when the door would open, it wouldn't go up past the opening. It would actually stick down into the, the door opening about eight inches. So that's why I could never get my truck in here. So by getting the door to open, that was one of the things I had to, to get taken care of. The other thing was at the very top up here, there was a piece of trim like this, or like a one by two piece of trim that I removed. And that's what was a, what, that was what gave me the clearance to actually get this thing pulled in here. So, um, so yeah, so I'm stoked because it's been four years this thing's been sitting in my driveway and my Tacoma has been parked in the garage and I love this thing. I've had it for 18 years. It's got 264,000 miles on it and it's, it's treated me well. Um, but it's worth uh, about one tenth of what this thing is worth so it got booted out anyways um this opener let me show you it's really cool man it's super quiet first of all and i dig this dead bolt that it's got once it closes super secure and it just mounts right up To the top to that bar and spins the door it spins the bar opens the door it's, it's like so simple and killer not cheap but it was worth every penny anyways um update on the truck so my seats are in they came in on thursday um my buddy josh ordered them for me because he's a prp dealer and he was able to get them a little quicker than I would have been able to by just ordering them online and even though he is a dealer it still took I think almost seven weeks for him to get them so who knows how long would it took for me if I would have just ordered them online um, so they're here um, I decided when I so he's gonna make me some custom uh, seat brackets because uh, PRP they sell like some generic brackets but he's gonna build me some custom ones um, for the seats so when I bring it over there for that um, at the same time I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do the cage at the same time he hasn't quoted me a price on that yet he's not 100% sure what it's gonna cost um, but depending on what the price is of the cage I'll probably end up just having that done all at the same time so uh, pretty much all that's left uh, is the cage putting the seats in I have the new dash pad in my living room I've not installed it yet I'm gonna pull this old one out and I'm gonna paint the bottom of the dash to match the outside of the truck I have a whole bunch of rattle can 383 green so it's it'll be fine it'll look good it just it looks kind of wonky with it being tan and nothing else I'm also gonna paint uh, the kick, those kick plate, the kick panels down there, which by the way, I could not find anywhere. Um, I thought I had them, I, I actually paid for some and thought I had them ordered. And after two months, I finally emailed the company. I can't remember the name of the company. I think it was USA one or something. They said, Oh, they're unavailable. So I'm just going to pull those off and paint those probably just paint them black. Um, so yeah, between the new seats, the cage and the dash, uh, that's it guys. I think I'm gonna end up calling this project done The only other thing I'm gonna do uh, Down the road is do an atlas transfer case um, And I know there's probably a four to five month wait To get that right now. Everything is like just insanely hard to get right now parts are just it's everything's back ordered. It's nuts so that's it once uh once uh, that's done, I'm pretty much done with the truck. I mean, it's 
it's done. I mean, there's it's never really going to be done, but I'm going to call it done as far as everything else I do will be just like stuff that really doesn't matter. <clears throat> um, anyways, once that stuff is done, once I get the seats in, the dash taken care of, and the cage done, I'm going to make uh, an update video on those things. And when I do that, I'll probably go through and let you guys know what this whole project cost me. Um, it's way more than I thought it was going to be, but it's worth every penny. Um, I have every receipt, almost every receipt for everything I've bought for this truck. And I'll show you guys that stack of receipts in the video. Um, anyways, hope you guys are all doing well. Um, like I said, as soon as I get that stuff installed, uh, definitely make an update video and let you guys know what's going on. Anyways, hope everyone's doing good and we'll see you guys later.